nice. And last but not least, purple jellyfish jelly. What if I add all of them into here? Ready to be my taste tester, Patrick? Good gravy. Sure, SpongeBob. To make the secret sauce, you'll need more of these ingredients. Touch an ingredient to add it to the beaker. One. That smells what, Patrick? You know what I mean? I don't even want to know. Ooh, it just farted. Let's see here. Oh my god. Oh wow! Hmm. This is fun. I like having fun. We're out of everything. Oh, that sucks. Bikini bottom to collect ingredients. That sucks big time. Use your pen to choose a game. Okay. Okay, what the heck are you doing, Jesus? Huh? Oh, you're talking about this, right, Foxy? Yeah, what in the world are you doing? Okay, so long story short, Bonnie gave me this to play learning games for um, when I get ready to go to school. Since he plans on enrolling me there and he wants me to learn stuff before I make it there. So like I said, he gave me this and, um, and pretty much what it is, is it's a handheld device that you can add cartridges into to play games. <clears throat> learning games K through third grade or wait hold on I think it's second no it's kindergarten through uh first grade and Bonnie wants me to keep up on these little game things to well learn how to count my ABCs and just life skills in general you know just all that sorts of stuff and right now as you can see I'm playing a little Spongebob game where pretty much I gotta learn how to well find solutions to problems which in this case I gotta find some sort of ingredients to help make a secret sauce for the Krabby Patty formula. Well, not really the Krabby Patty formula, but just some ingredients because, well, Mr. Krabs' customers are being taken away to another restaurant and they need, like, a new secret ingredient. And I need to collect them up to make a new one. So, yeah, that's just about it. Oh, okay, nice. Do you have any more games besides that? Yeah, I do, but the problem is right now is that I don't know where they went, and this game is pretty interesting for me to play, so just leave me alone and let me do me right now, okay, Foxy? Uh, okay then, Jesus, you do you. Alright, back to the game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. Anywho, I'm bored. You're bored, you say? Yeah, Bonnie, I'm, like, really, really bored. Well, that's great, because, well, I need help on something. And it takes two people in order to get the job done. Okay, what exactly do you need help with, Bonnie? Well, um, I need help summoning a spirit. Wait, what? Summoning? Summoning a spirit? Yeah, but it's not exactly the type of spirit you're thinking of. The demon kinds and all that sorts of crap. It's a good spirit. Uh, Bonnie, you can't summon good spirits, you know, unless you pray. But we are not getting into religion, so what exactly kind of spirit do you need help summoning? An owl. Um, why specifically an owl? Eh, no reason. Seriously, Bonnie? There's no reason at all to why you want to freaking summon a spirit, specifically an owl? <sighs> okay, so in the spiritual realm... Owls represent wisdom, and I am lacking all sorts of wisdom that I really need to know. Bonnie, you're a scientist, doctor, and an engineer. Oh, and maybe an archaeologist and a surgeon. What more wisdom do you need to know that will make your life better? Explain that to me. <sighs> I want to figure out who exactly I am truly on the inside. I'm not just some archaeologist, surgeon, scientist, doctor 
and an engineer, Foxy. There's so much more to that. But I need to know what that is. Like, I haven't really understood how to look so deeply inside myself to understand who I really am. And the only way to, for me to understand what my true potential is, is to summon the Owl of Wisdom. He or she has the answers for everything. And unfortunately, I don't. So Foxy, can you please help me? Pretty please with the cherry on top. I really want to know and need to know who I am. Hmm. Okay, Bonnie, I'll help you out. Yay! But... Huh? But what? What do I get in return for helping you out? Well, shoot, Foxy, I haven't thought about that. Uh... I don't know, what do you want? Hmm. You see that styrofoam ball over there, Bonnie? Huh? You're talking about that one, right? Yeah. Okay, what about it? Give me that. Um, okay. After we're done summoning the owl, all right? All right. Take me to wherever we have to go to summon it. All right, let's go. Wait, also, Bonnie, um, one more thing. Huh? What's up, Foxy? I want that TV over there. Huh? Um, Foxy? Yes, Bonnie? That's going to be for all of us in our new house when we get it. Oh, okay. Never mind, just lead me to where we have to go now. Sorry about the disruptance. It's fine. Now, follow me. Alright. Ugh. Arg. Okay, whoa, that was epic. But what the heck? What is this place? Well, it's kind of like a dump, but less messier. So what, is this just a place where people dump their old stuff off? Yeah, same thing. Anyways, now that we're here, I think now's the time to summon the Wisdom Owl. <clears throat> owl of Wisdom, I think you mean. Eh, it don't matter. It's still the same thing. Anyways, are you ready, Foxy? Uh, duh. I just want to hurry up and get this thing done and over with, and then let's just all go home and go to bed. Like, I'm tired. Yeah, me too. Let's just hurry up and get this done. I need this little spiritual dude to be in my presence for now on, so get over here, Foxy. Okay, but then what? Just repeat what I say, okay? All right. Oh, Wisdom Owl, I beg of you. Oh, Wisdom Owl, I beg of you. Appear into my presence to give me the wisdom. Appear into my presence and give me the wisdom. The wisdom I need and the wisdom I beg for. The wisdom I need and the wisdom I beg for. Oh, Owl of Wisdom, appear. Oh, Owl of Wisdom, appear. dares call upon the wisdom one it was us owl of wisdom oh it's just you bonnie and it seems that you brought your friend along as well well obviously because you need two people to call upon me but what is it that you need exactly bunny boy since i'm going to be staying in your presence for a while what is up exactly I need you to answer me something. Well, obviously, or else you wouldn't be calling me. So what exactly would that be? I've been having a difficult time to look deeply inside myself to understand who I actually am. So, who am I? And what is my greatest potential? I don't have the answer to that question, Bonnie. But what I can say to you is if you really want to know who exactly you are, give yourself some alone time to think. For yourself and for yourself only. Think of everything you accomplished so far. And just everything in general that you have done. Think about the friends that you have made over the years. And why you're their friends to this day. Just think. All of this doesn't happen in one setting. You don't get to understand what kind of person or who you are in general. All in one day. You have to give yourself time to think. Quit going to everybody to look for the answers that you need. Find it out yourself. And like I said, all you need to do is just think and give yourself some alone time. But now, is that all you needed me for, Bonnie? Yeah, pretty much. But wait, all I need to do is to think for myself? That's it? Yes, Bonnie. That is all you need to do. Why are you struggling so badly to understand that? Well... If you come to think of it, me being so busy all the time, I haven't really had time to think about stuff for myself or anything. So, huh. Good point there, Wisdom. 
Thanks for the advice, but how am I supposed to give myself time to think when I'm so busy all the time? I literally take no break unless I'm eating food or going to the bathroom, or taking a shower at least. So what do I need to do to give myself some time? Hmm, clearly this wasn't all that you needed me for. If you want to give yourself time, finish all what you need to do. Don't stress yourself too much about everything because life is too short to do all of that. Also, there is another thing you could do to try making time for yourself. Make a schedule for the things that you want and have to do. You can always take breaks to use the bathroom, to eat food, or just anything in general. Just find time for when you actually need a long, long break from everything and to give yourself some time to think. Just get all what you're working on done and then think for yourself when you are ready. Just finish off what needs to be done, like I just said. The less stuff you have on your mind, the more time you can think. Or the more time you have to think for yourself. Hmm, it seems so. How am I going to get stuff finished so quickly in order for me to give myself some time to think? Before you go to bed tonight, think about the tasks that you have to accomplish the next day. Just write yourself a little schedule thing for what needs to be done at a certain time. Hmm. Alright. Thanks for letting me know there. But how will I know to do certain stuff at a certain time? By coming up with the time, date, and place you're going to accomplish a task. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. Have any advice for how I can manage my time easily? Just speak less and work more on the task that you need to accomplish. Stay silent and pay attention to what you're doing. Or as what your teacher would say, keep your eye on your own paper and pay attention to what you are doing so you are not messing up. Just don't get distracted. Hmm. Seems easy, but when you come to think of it, taking action is a lot harder. Can you help me write a schedule thing, like out on a calendar? That is something I cannot do. That is something you must come up with in your own time. It's not anybody else's job but your own. If you want to get things done, do it by yourself. Figure things out on your own and the way you want it to be. It's way easier to do something yourself because you're getting it done faster in your own little way. Okay, okay, say no more, say no more. How exactly am I going to give myself time when I have so much things that need to be getting done or finished that may take forever? I know I said that you have to do things on your own in order to get it done, but if you ever need any help, just ask a friend and give them instruction on what they should do in order to get things done a lot easier besides working by yourself because there's more work on your hands to do than there is with other people working along by your side. Okay, okay, all right, I got you, I got you. Anyways, I think, um, me questioning you is done here for now. Are you sure? Yeah, I think I'm done here. Anyways, Foxy, do you want to go home now? Yeah, I'm tired and I'm hungry. So if you don't mind, I think I'm going to go get my styrofoam ball, and I'm done volunteering. So, see you later, Bonnie. Well, wait, I'm coming with you, so don't see you later me yet. Hmm. I think he's too far out of your reach to even say anything to him. So you might as well just forget about him waiting for you to come with him. Yeah, you're probably right. Anyways... Now that you're stuck into our world, do you want to come home and stay at my place? Since there's no way for you to go back to the spiritual realm unless I say certain words in order for you to do that. Hmm. If there's any other spiritual type creatures there, then yes, I will, sure. But the real question is, is there? Well, there's um, two guys with powers that are mortals and stuff. Golden Freddy and Phantom Foxy. Eh. It's close enough to a spirit. I mean, pretty much they are anyways, because I do see them in the spiritual realm all the time. Mainly Phantom Foxy, because, well, he's a phantom-like creature. But, Gold Freddy, that's occasional. The only thing that makes him look like a spiritual-like creature is his eyes. Ooh, them eyes. Pitch black, 
with the white light coming out of them. Ooh-wee. Yeah, 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 whatever, enough of that talk. Let's just go, Wisdom. Oh, right, I forgot. I will be on my way, but for now, I shall meditate to get my energy back, also known as my brain power. <sighs> Well, now that everything's back to its original color, I shall go now. But to be sure that I'm looking like my mortal human form, well, just mortal form because I'm not really human, I'm like an animal spirit creature. Let me just look at my reflection real quick. Okay, yes, I look like as how I should. Anyways, now to the Fazbear's house. Arg! Hui! Oof! Ow! Well, that was a lovely walk. Well, run, I should really say. Yep, truly. Anyways, I think I'm gonna go to bed. Yeah, me too. I'll talk to you tomorrow, Bonnie. Yeah, talk to you tomorrow. See you later, though. Yeah, bye. <sighs> Excuse me there, Bonnie, but where am I going to stay? Oh crap, I forgot about you. <laughs> My bad. Sorry about that wisdom. <sighs> it's fine. Just tell me where I am going to be sleeping, please. I'm getting really, really, really impatient. My patience is always short. So like I said, just tell me where I'm going to stay. Oh, yeah, 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 um, right. Uh, I haven't really thought about that. Give me a second, please. To, well, think. <sighs> all right. That's all you needed to say, but my patience is running out, so please hurry up. Whoops, I almost forgot my styrofoam ball. <sighs> if you don't mind, I'm just gonna go through and then grab my styrofoam ball and then leave. Ugh. Uh, yeah, you do that, Foxy. <clears throat> Ugh, Bonnie, I need a little help here. Can you help me lift this up and take it home, please? Huh? Uh, I'll get back to you in a minute, Wisdom. But yeah, I'll help you, Foxy. Alright, um, just help me push it down there. Since my home is just below. Yeah, 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 alright. You know, I think I could do it myself, Foxy. Just get off of it for a second. Oh, uh, right, my bad. Take your time. Hurry up. Um... Foxy, a little problem. Uh, what's wrong? Um, well, you see here, the ball is kind of stuck and will not go down. Well, shoot. <sighs> Maybe just push down on it. Maybe a little go. Oh, uh, good thing in there. But if it doesn't work, what do I do then? Oh, um, if it doesn't work, then we're gonna have to lift it up and then actually just take the effort to go over there and then throw it off to the side so I can go go and get it and just go home and stuff. Alrighty, Foxy, if you say so. Anyways, um, stay back and I'm gonna do this. Ugh. You know what, maybe if I could push it off. Okay, it's not going anywhere, never mind. So, um, should I just pull it out of here and then just throw it over off to the side? Or throw it over the edge? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. All right. Got it! Alright, well, I'm gonna go downstairs, so, um, just throw it, and afterward you can get back to whatever you were doing, alright? Yeah, 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 right, Foxy, right. Ugh. Okay, go get it. Alright, see you later, Bonnie. Woo! Yeah, 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 see you later, Foxy. Anyways, back to what I was doing. Huh. took you long enough. Yeah, 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 I'm sorry. I really am. Anyways, a place for you to stay, aka sleep. Hmm. I mean, there's that box, but then again, Jesus and Snowball stays in there, so crap. Huh? Did somebody say something? Oh, I was just trying to figure out for a place to sleep. Well, not for me, but for this owl right here. Oh, and let me guess, you're thinking that she could stay in here? Yeah, I was thinking that, but you and Snowball are in there. Hey! I'm in here too, and I think three's enough. Oh yeah, and Sparky too. So, um, do you guys have any idea where she could sleep or stay? Uh, well in here, no, that's for sure. But I mean, uh, she could stay over there in that box thingy, the little bucket-like nest thing. Maybe that's a comfortable place to sleep. I mean, we're talking about birds here, so. She could just go sleep over there. Hmm. Oh, well, it looks like we found where you're sleeping. 
Ahem, <clears throat> staying at least. Wait a minute. You want me to stay in that thing? Yeah, it's the only place for you to stay. Uh, I mean, I guess it's okay, so screw it. I'm only staying here for I don't even know how long, so I might as well just make the most of it. Besides, it's the only place to sleep, so eh. Guess I'll have to find something to do when I'm bored, being a spiritual owl of what I am. Anyways, see you guys later. Yeah, and now back to what I was doing and what you guys were doing. Let's all just go to sleep. Yeah, dude, agreed. <clears throat> yeah, 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 all right. Ugh. Well, good night to all of you. Yeah, good night. Yeah, dude, good night. Good night. <sighs> Oof. Ugh. Well then, this is actually more comfortable than I expected it to be. Eh, never mind though, I should probably get some rest. Rest my owl spirit. Well, myself in general. Not really gonna get any sleep, cause spirits don't rest. So, I guess I'm just going to meditate. <sighs>